Hi everyone, in front of me I've got Motorola Razr 60 Ultra and let me show with you how to add the fingerprint to this device. Uh, so let's begin with opening the settings and here we have to scroll down and find security and privacy. Let's stop. Then we have to go and find device unlock and here tap on fingerprint. So if you've got the, um, the screen lock currently applied, you will have to enter it to confirm everything and then uh, simply proceed with adding the fingerprint. However, if you do not have a regular screen lock like the pattern pin or password, your device will require you to add it right now. It is necessary because if for some reason the fingerprint sensor won't work, then you will still be able to unlock your device. So just uh, set the, uh, the screen lock and then you will be able to add the fingerprint. So let me just enter my uh, screen lock and here we've got the information about the fingerprint sensor. So just tap on setup and here we've got the info that uh, we have to put our finger on the sensor which in this device is located on the power button uh, of our device on the right side. So let me put my finger on it. It has been detected and now we have to add it. So just put your finger on the sensor, you will feel vibration and do it multiple times in order to add your fingerprint fully. So try to catch every part of it for better recognition. So move your finger uh, to add it correctly. All right, we've got it. That was quite easy. Uh, so let's stop on done. This is the fingerprint section. We can uh, rename it or remove our fingerprint, add another fingerprint, and here we can decide whether we want to touch to unlock. And to be honest, in my uh, in my opinion, it is better to have this option turned on because all you have to do to unlock your device is to simply put your finger on the sensor. If um, you will have this turned off, you will have to not only put it, but also press it, which is obviously not really that hard, but uh, it could be a little bit uncomfortable in certain situations. So just be aware about that. So now all we have to do is to lock our device and check if it is working. So let me put my finger on the sensor and as you can see, it is unblocked. Moreover, it will work the same with the uh, external display. If you've got it here, uh, you can simply put your finger on the sensor, so on the uh, power button and it will be also unblocked and you can now freely use your device. All right, so that will be all. Thank you so much for watching. Please hit the subscribe button and leave the thumbs up. Thank you.